Larry Vaught of the Danville Advocate Messenger is reporting Morgan Newton will get the start this Saturday when the Cats take the field against Auburn. Rich Brooks said today Will Fiddler and Newton were just okay in practice. Now, even though there's a report that says Newton is the starter, Brooks isn't letting on one way or the other. Maybe it has. Huh? Maybe the scuttlebutt's right. Maybe it's wrong. <laughs> like I said, you guys are going to have a lot of fun with this. You know, it would be a lot easier for me to just say, okay, so-and-so starting, and then you guys can start picking that decision apart. But now you can kind of go your own way and pick pick your own starters <laughs> and run your own polls. And has it been made? Hasn't it been made? That's a fun thing for you guys. Everybody's got an opinion on the quarterback. Why would our team be any different than the fan base or the media? You know, I mean, everybody's got an opinion on it. So, uh they just have to understand that uh, when the decision is made, we're making it uh, for, the, for the correct reason uh, to try to win this game and the rest of them. Now, Brooks says part of the reason why he hasn't named a starter yet is so Auburn won't know who to prepare for, and it's working. It's really, the issue is not necessarily who's at quarterback because he can throw better and do this. It's who's at quarterback because that's going to dictate what type of offense they run. Does that make sense? So, I mean, it's not, it's not who's at quarterback and what throws can he make and, and things of that nature. If this one's at quarterback, then this is the offense you're going to see. If this one's at quarterback, then they can go business as usual with the rest of the offense that they've run all year. UK offensive lineman Jake Lenefsky has torn his ACL and suffered some cartilage damage. He'll have surgery and will miss the rest of the season. UK cornerback Paul Warford practiced today and could play this weekend if his injured quad responds the right way. Warford has missed the last two games. And the UK football team has picked up another commitment in the class of 2010. According to the Cats Pauls, it's Eric Simmons out of Atlanta, Georgia. He's a six foot, 180 pound corner who runs a 4-3-8-40. He chose Kentucky over Middle Tennessee State and New Mexico. George Rogers Clark knocked off Henry Clay last Friday 12 to 6 behind solid defense and the play of quarterback Andrew Deeney. His two touchdown passes have earned Deeney the high school highlight reel star of the week. GRC wasted no time taking advantage of opportunities against Henry Clay last Friday, turning a first quarter turnover into points. It was a throwback play to Corey Rogers. You know, he's a big target. Sometimes he knows what I'm going to do when I run a rail. 